guess what I found? I found the last crate, so let's tag it and uh, end this portion of the mission. Alright, prototype procure. Station is secure, we should return to the ship. I didn't think I didn't think I was ever gonna find that stupid crate, especially with the uh, especially with the tricorder not working. Captain, Salarn has completed the preparations and the mines are ready to be deployed. We need to travel to the uh, Tiniba system and set up the minefield near the, near the transwarp conduit there. Um, what's with this sudden blackness here? That was a, that was weird. All right, time to, time to, uh, time to move around a bit. Pass the, uh, Past the enemy contact here. Let me let me check my map here. All right, that's thankfully that's not that far. Though of course, with all these enemy contacts here, I'm always running the risk of a. Uh, always run the risk of uh, running into one of them. There it is. Uh, there it is. It just appeared in the uh, just a, just appeared in the distance. Is that a, uh, is that a Diedrich Warbird there? Not exactly, yeah, that's a, that's one of those Warbirds. Alright, but thankfully there's our target. I think I can get to the, uh, let me, let me head a little bit over to the side here. go into the uh, into the deal to continue with the mission captain you must remove those uh Rubidium bearing asteroids from the uh, deployment zone. The high rubidium content will mask the trace, metal, trace metals in Starfleet hulls. The mine's detection system is unable to compensate for this variance, and they will attack both friend and foe. This is unacceptable. Unacceptable. All right, so we've got asteroids to blow up. It's kind of like that a uh, kind of like that one one Davidian mission where I had to destroy an asteroid. Though uh, thankfully, thankfully this is not going to be as obnoxious since I won't have constant Klingon ships harassing me. and let's see about let's see about taking care of the uh, let's see about firing off a plasma torpedo even though it, for some reason it looks like I fired off two plasma torpedoes though 
though I'm sure it only counted as one torpedo. Alright. Oh great. And it left a little left more asteroids. Yeah, this is this is definitely like that one Davidian asteroid. I destroy I destroy one one asteroid and it splits off into more pieces. Actually, to tell you the truth, I might not have. I might not have to do this. It still counts as destroy the large asteroids. I might not actually have to do that with the uh, with the uh, with the uh, smaller asteroid chunks. All right, let's go deal with this one then. And see if I, see if it, that's true. Plasma torpedo, quantum torpedo. Yeah, and for some reason it labels them as a. For some reason it labels the uh, tor torpedoes, the asteroids as enemies, despite the fact that, uh, despite the fact that they're not really uh, enemies. of that one. So let's take care of this one. Right. Let me let me have a look and see where the rest of these torpedoes and asteroids are. If I knew where the rest of the asteroids are, I mean they they split off. They split off when they're destroyed, but I don't think you have to. Uh, I don't think you have to destroy the asteroid remains. Two, one. Okay, I'm having a bit of a problem finding the last asteroids. This may have to be like the, uh, wait, 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 there was something down here. Right, I just ran right into that.
No, that's a ship. Anyways, uh, I'm going to search around a bit, and when I when I find and destroy the last asteroid, I'll when I find and destroy the last 